condemning the resolution of Manipur Assembly to urge Centre to abrogate Su Pact, the 10 Kuki Zomi Mar MLAs expressed their dissent and disapproval, terming the decision as one-sided. A joint statement issued by the MLAs said the decision was emanating from prejudice, bias and hatred for the Kuki Zomi Mar community that reflects a myopic view on the issue. The statement pointed out that the tripartite SU was first signed on August 22, 2008 and subsequently renewed periodically with clearly laid down ground rules. Accordingly, there is a strong mechanism in place called Joint Monitoring Group Compromising of Central Agencies, State Government Agencies and the Kuki National Organization KNO, and United People's Front UPF, representatives meant for overseeing adherence to the ground rules. The MLAs questioned whether the resolution adopted by the August House was based on any report or observations of the JMG, which is the only official mechanism to determine whether any violation of the ground rules has taken place or not. The agreement was loaded as the harbinger of peace and security in the state, and when it was signed, and truly so Manipur, particularly the hill districts have witnessed a sea change in the security scenario as the level of violence came down drastically in the years that followed added the MLAs. Successive governments have been taking their share of credit over improvement in the law and order situation in the state owing to signing of the pact, they continued. The recent signing of a peace accord with a, U, with a new NLF faction was initiated by the state and the role played by this outfit during the current violence is widely known to one and all. The August House resolution would have evinced fairness and peace objectives if the role played by the outfit cited above too was highlighted as it is a clear case for seeking termination of the pact. They asserted the resolution was adopted to defame the KNO and UPF and further alienate the Kuki Zomi Mar community as part of the continuing hate campaign. The legislators appealed to, to the Union Home Ministry to consider all aspects of the issue in a fair and just manner to check further discrimination and alienation of the Kuki Zomi Mar people.